Hello everyone. I'm here to talk about Broca's aphasia versus Wernicke aphasia. Speaking, first of all, there will be speaking physiology, cognition, due to Wernicke's area, then Broca's area, and facial area of motor cortex, then cranial nerves, then speak. Speaking, the meaning of words are processed in Wernicke's area. So it pro process in Wernicke's area and then sent to Broca's area, which stores motor programs for speaking words. Moreover, morphemes, the smallest linguistic that has semantic meaning, are assembled here. Therefore, the model suggests that Broca's area is in charge of articulating words Subsequently, the instruction for words are sent to the facial area of motor cortex and then sent to the facial motor neurons in the brainstem, which then sends out order to facial muscles in order to produce sound. Aphasia, a general term for speech and language disorders, usually result from insult like strokes, tumors, abscesses to the dominant hemisphere, the left hemisphere in greater than 95% of right-handed people and 60 to 80% of left-handed people. Broca's aphasia is a motor aphasia, expressive aphasia or non-fluent aphasia. Vonic aphasia is the sensory aphasia, fluent aphasia or receptive aphasia. Broca's aphasia is a disorder of language production including writing with intact comprehension due to an insult to Broca's area in the posterior, inferior, frontal gyrus, often secondary to left superior middle cerebral artery stroke. It is also known as motor aphasia. Wernicke's aphasia, disorder of language comprehension with intact yet nonsensical production due to an insult to Wernicke, Wernicke's area in the left posterior superior temporal perisalvian gyrus, often secondary to left inferior posterior middle cerebral artery embolic stroke. Here is the motor speech area, Broca's area. Here is the language comprehension area, which is Wernicke area. And here is the arti uh, arcuate fasciculus between two areas. So location, Broca's aphasia is the posterior inferior frontal gyrus, Wernicke's aphasia left posterior superior temporal gyrus. Broca's is broken and Wernicke's is wordy. So I'll always remember there will be a broken words in Broca's area and Wernicke's area will be like words, what, like that. So thank you very much for watching. Visit my YouTube channel and blog, MedGameTube. And my blog is MBBS Medicine Humanity First. You can just search on Google. And thank you very much.